Good morning, Jacob here. It is 4 a.m. bright and early. Getting up, getting ready for my first ever bass tournament. I'm fishing this one with Lawson. So we're not taking my boat, I'm gonna hop on his. I'm super stoked, been practicing for this. It's on a very tough lake. It's gonna be super windy today, but I just got you know, those pregame jitters. Grew up playing basketball, so I've always been competitive into sports and I'm just excited to be competing for something again. I'm stoked, gotta get some gas, get some fuel for myself and go meet Lawson at the ramp. Let's get to it. All right, we are now on the lake. Tournament has started, we just left the launch. There was two pretty nice freaking boats following us to the spot. Lawson got the tin can pushing, beat them to the spot. We're gonna start fishing. Lawson's throwing a buzz bait. I'm throwing a whopper plopper. It's tournament time, baby, let's get it. I don't really like how this thing's plopping right now. Do it, don't. Oh, no. It's kind of slow to getting the pop going. I think I got it real faster. I'll probably switch to non top water quicker than you do just so you can throw it a little longer and we're throwing something different. Yeah. All right, chatterbait. Do your work. What are you throwing right now? Yeah. That's close enough to the chatter where I'll throw this right now. It seemed both in like. <laughs> I was gonna say that thrash seemed both in esque. One thing I will say about Guggen baits, to humans, they definitely have the best smelling bait. <laughs> if bass have the same nose as me. Yeah, thing smells good. I think so. I think it's small though. Grab or keep? He'll, he'll, I think he'll keep. Well, he's gotta be 12. I mean, he doesn't have to be 12 inches. They said this lake is so tough that they do a pride system. <laughs> but, um, but, you know, standard 12 inches. I think he is 12 though. I think so too, but. I was bleeding and choked it. Bad, he's putting on your jacket. <laughs> That's in his tongue. I'm holding on for dear life and I'll put him in the water for a second. There we go. I'm not sure what the deal was, but. Some of that fresh water, brother. <laughs> Alright, we got first fish in the boat. I have fished this lake twice now, and both times I have gotten skunked. So already off to a better start as Lawson almost falls in the water. <laughs> so yeah, already off to a better start than I have in the past on this lake. So stoked for the day. That was on a shaky head Senko green pumpkin blue flake. I was just talking about how I love the scent of Guggen baits. That is one thing I do like about them. Um, um, if bass had the same nose as me, then it probably smells good to them too. Let's go get some more fish. All right, this is the winning bait right here. First fish in the boat, getting it rigged back up. I'm gonna get back after it. Crazy on this rod, that fish wasn't even that big, but boat flipping him was a little difficult. <laughs> it was a very nonchalant eat. Yeah, I just kind of picked it up and swam very slowly with it. I'm gonna live and die by the worm for a little bit so you can experiment. All right, same bait, but I switched over to a weightless. I just kind of like that slower fall. I feel like a lot of times I catch bass on that first cast when it's first dropping. So that's what I'm kind of looking for with going to this weightless instead of the shaky head. The only thing I don't like about it being weightless is I kind of like the thought of it making a little bit of noise when it hits the bottom. I might put on a 1 8 ounce tungsten. It's 
small. It won't even weigh. Unless you want to keep it. <laughs> Maybe an eight incher. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, this guy. This guy's not gonna get weighed. He's gonna get sent right back. I'm at Sanko again. Yep, yep. That was Yep, right on that tree. I mean, that's like a good thing about having two people, though, is I can keep doing that while you try to experiment if you want. We have one fish. One fish. We show up to the ramp. We just got five fish in our cooler. Oh, nice. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? Oh, I thought that's what we were supposed to do. Bowfin. Uh. <laughs> I think it's a bowfin. Yeah. That's why it felt like a good fish. I'm trying to like let him swim down so he stops making noise. Oh, thank you. That bowfin might be my best friend. All right, six ankles later. One keeper fish, one non-keeper fish, one bowfin. Yeah. No one probably ever fishes it. Yeah. I can't tell. Oh, it's a, might be a keeper, but... Oh! Yeah. Dang it, though. He would have kept. I didn't see, did you see it? Okay. <laughs> Sad. Dang, he's thick. You're <laughs> thick, dude. This is not a small bowfin. Oh, thank you. It's about the same thing. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it was in that little patch of grass. I was hoping I'd catch a big one in front of this boat. I think this bait will still work. I'll probably continue to throw it. <laughs> and like all the other setups I have are essentially like the same thing. Get. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My GoPro batteries over. <laughs> Easy twelve. He is in fact twelve keep, and a half. Keep, 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 keep. <laughs> Never been more excited over a twelve pound, FL, twelve pound, FL, twelve FL, inch FL, bass. FLW, here we come. Major what League I, Bass Tournament's calling my name, what son. Todd's got a little gut on him, at least. I <laughs> know the first one. No. Think so? Yeah. Okay. It feels better than the last one. It's waking. That makes me think it's. Oh, okay. What? I don't know, that seems like a largey. Yeah, because I think he might have been, he felt bigger than, yeah. Dang. For a place that I have fished twice now and caught zero fish, I've got four fish now, I think. Mm -hmm. um, two that we've kept. We've got three fish now in the live well, so I'm honestly feeling pretty good, even though we're catching small fish. We're fishing a tournament today, so it's really just about for me just the experience and having fun and honestly it's been a blast just having that competitive mindset it's been super fun um, i'm not going to talk too long because we're on a time crunch let's go catch some more fish i think so Away. That, that's a buzzer beater right there. <laughs> I tried so hard to just get him in the boat as fast as I could. 
Let's go. That's a buzzer beater right there. Another one of those, uh... It's funny, he's not big, but we don't have five fish, so and he helps. He's also fat. Uh, plenty of water. All right, that was fish number four. You have about probably like 40, 45 minutes left to fish. So honestly, to get to that fifth fish, any fish is great at this point, just to give us a little more weight to that bag right now. Be nice if it's a big one, lost and tossed on the spinner bait. Super windy we're fishing right now, so pretty good idea. Might as well swing for the fences. I'm still gonna throw this worm just to see if I can get that fifth fish. We're gonna try it with a bang here. Oh, that's a bass, that's a bass. It was like a three pounder. Yeah, that was a nice one. Ooh. We're in the right area. <laughs> Ooh. Not quite the results that we would want. Four <laughs> fish out of our five. Probably a little over four pound bag. Um, it hasn't been what it, we wanted it to be fishing, to be honest. Um, for me, it's my best day on this lake, so I can't be too upset. Woohoo! Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> um, honestly, though, it was still a fun day. I, I mean, honestly. It's really tough condition. Yeah, it's like blowing about 18 miles per hour. You can probably hear that. And yeah, it was just, just a tough day, but honestly, I had a ton of fun. On to weigh in. All right, weigh in is over. We probably would have been around four to five pounds, but first, second, and third were all around seven pounds. So we decided, no, we're not even gonna weigh our fish. We just left in the boat and just hung out with the guys for a little bit. Um, <laughs> I don't wanna talk about it. <laughs> Sore moment for a loss right now. That one fish that we lost at the end there, probably, probably would have put us- big fish and whatever. Yeah, we probably would have won big fish and first place, but that's just how it goes first tournament it was a blast honestly I had a ton of fun it was really cool to experience it we're gonna go release the fish call the day all right we got the boat out of the water that does it for our first bass tournament adventure everyone uh leave a comment down below for Lawson he's a little uh, <laughs> he's a little upset give him some encouragement about losing our game winning fish I would have won big fish and we would have won the tournament 280 bones flushed down the toilet. <laughs> hey, but we had fun. Appreciate you watching. Stay tuned for the next one. Send up a prayer for my man lost and he's about to drive home with this tire. Look at that cracking. What was the winning weight, your guys? Uh, 